Thank you so much, Graham. Now, speaking, of course, of women achieving good things together, listen to this next story. Children deserve the best. We know this, and, uh, of course, we have to give them everything that we can. And through the hands of the Smile Foundation, children with facial abnormalities in Kimberley are getting a second chance. Now, Kutle visited Kimberley in uh, the Northern Cape to find out about these life-changing surgeries. <sighs> We all know that our smile is what we present to the world. However, for burn victims, their confidence is affected in ways that many may never understand. But thanks to Dr. Maria and her collaboration with the Smile Foundation, children are in a position to receive life-changing surgery because of the revamped burns unit at the Robert Mangaliso Sobukwe Hospital. Dr. Maria, it's such a pleasure to meet you. The work that you are doing here in collaboration with the Smile Foundation is absolutely incredible. Thank you for welcoming us. Thank you very much for being here. How would you describe the work that you do here in the Burns Unit? We have very serious work here. That is um, amazing. It's very challenging because we deal with kids, children burned here, having pain. So we have uh, challenges, but we love what we do. And you see it on the smiles on the children's faces, right? Yeah, you have to uh, say that is a smile that is, uh, is a joy uh, after we treat them because it's a very painful injury. Speaking about smiles, how did the collaboration with the Smile Foundation, you know, come about and why was it important for you to see it through? And I was always seeing that the Smile Foundation was supporting academic hospitals. So I was always harassing them. When are you coming to Kimberley? And then 2017, we had our first Smile Week. So we had facial deformities and also deformities post burns. And then in 2019, we had the first of the three phases of this refurbishing. We had the first one in 2019, the second phase in 2022, and uh, now we are waiting for the good heart of uh, people to donate to Smile Foundation, to Avela, to complete their phase three of the award. And how would you say that the revamped Burns unit has made a difference? Would you like to be treated in a ward where everything is falling apart? No and most of the patients are from low social conditions. So they are in a very nice beauty environment. So it's important that we have a good environment and a team that gives love to the patient. That is where we have this unit uh, refurbished, revamped, is still waiting for phase three. How hard has it been for you and Junior and the entire family since the incident? I was crying. Mary, I told myself that Mujimute. So I take Junior to the hospital at Haspatir. And how has the recovery been like, you know, since that happened and you moving to the Burns unit here at Robert Soboko Hospital? It was nice. Mm. The first time when I came in that in that wood, I see that there's too much friendly doctors and too much friendly nurses. That's why I like it here. And my son healed very well. He want to play and he like the toys. There's a room that have toys there. He like it here. And he said to me that he didn't want to go home because he really like it here. Tony, can you please tell us more about Smile Foundation and what it aims to achieve? So Smile Foundation is a South African non-profit organization that supports children in need of reconstructive surgery. So it's children living with different types of anomalies such as cleft lip, cleft palate, um, severe burns, craniofacial abnormalities and other conditions. The, the purpose is to transform children's lives and ensure they live a life inspired by confidence and possibility. How can the public contribute and donate to this initiative? So they can visit smilefoundationsa.org. We have a, under fundraisers, there is a specific one to donate to Robert Mangaliso Subukwe Hospital Phase 3 Burns Unit. And it's as easy as that and every cent counts.
someone's smile and face is like a fingerprint unique to who they are. There's no question that every person and every child deserves a fulfilling, healthy and happy life. Absolutely incredible work being done here by Dr. Maria in collaboration with the Smile Foundation at the revamped Burns Unit of the Robert Magaliso Sobukwe Hospital where children's lives are being transformed for the better. Oh, Kutle, thank you very much for that. I, mean, I know that the Smile Foundation, they are doing incredible work, but they continuously need our support. So what you can do is you can visit smilefoundationsa.org if you would love to help children with facial abnormalities.